Hey, what's going on, Turbo Crew? Today we're going to be playing some more Farming Simulator 2019 here on Sandy Bay map. And we just finished mowing all of our hay for a little while. We're going to fire the 7210 up, take it back home, clean it up, wash it up, get it all clean, and we'll put it away. And then also we're going to start raking. We're going to rake today. Well, now we're hitting the front mower. It's either the back mower or the front. I can't watch both. It's hard to. But anyway, we're going to wash this stuff up. Probably service the tractor. Maybe later. I don't know. Whenever we get to take it to the shop. But we're going to plow everything up after we get it raked and baled and the bales moved off. That way we can fertilize our hay. Um, we might do that. I don't know if we will. We might be changing maps soon. I don't know. I know Losses Hills is going to come out soon, and that's a great map. I'd love to play on it. So, that. And also the Iowa map. I don't know when that one's going to be out. The UMRV map. I don't know for sure when that one's going to be out. But anyway, we're going to play on this one for a while, and then when we get done, we're going to transfer all of our stuff that we have now to the other map and our money. And probably some of the land. I don't know what, how we're going to do the land. We're going to back up. Just a little bit. Wash everything here. Wash this. Wash the tractor and the front mower. Okay, so we got everything washed up. Or this tractor washed up. We're going to put the mowers away in the shed. We'll go ahead and fold the back one. That way it's straight. Let's back it in here. Swing it in like so. Put it next to that one. Drop it off. We'll put the other mower over in this corner. Unhook it. Back up. And we'll hook this onto the tether, I think. So we'll back up here. Hook onto the tether. And we'll go ahead and shut that off. And that will be ready to go. And then we're going to go ahead and jump into the hay rake. And of course we got the baler there. So, And we're going to... Let's see, we got to ted all this first, actually. We don't need to rake it yet. So we'll go through, we're going to go ahead and ted all this. And then we'll rake it all. So we're going to go ahead and take this to the hay field. And run over our header trailer. We'll go ahead and unfold this. And then we'll drop it down, kick it on, and get it running here. So we're going to make all this to be hay, just so that we got a decent balance of hay in the shed. Then we'll have a good amount of hay, actually. So we probably won't plow it all. I don't know yet. But we're going to go ahead and roll into the time lapse here, probably. And we will get it all done. Okay, so we got done with this field. We're going to go ahead and pull out of here. Probably have to, I don't know. I thought maybe we'd have to back up and turn. 
But we are going to go to the next field here. It's a little bumpy. And then we'll probably end up breaking that field. And, of course, we have these two fields to Ted also. They have pretty good hills on them, so they take a little, a little bit longer. Just a little longer. Not a whole lot. But they ain't terrible, I guess. Mowing them sucked. I don't think tedding them or raking or bailing them. I think bailing, bailing might top the RPMs or the uh, whatever you want to call it out. But anyway, we're going to pull in this field. And we're going to ted this off camera. And we're going to get in the rake. And we will start raking that other patch. We'll just park it here, ready to go. And then we'll probably also bail it once we get done raking. We'll probably move the rake to the next field, actually. Today's going to be kind of a short video today because I'm kind of like into Christmas stuff and getting busy. And we're coming up at the end of school. By the time you guys have seen this video, I'm already out of school for the... Um, for the year technically so but yeah I got next semester to do but we're out for Christmas break by the time you guys are seeing this so you guys will be able to see a little longer videos maybe even two like two 10 minute videos maybe one in the morning one in the afternoon I'm not 100% sure but anyway we're going to finish raking this field shouldn't take me too long and then we will bail it and then probably stack it, maybe even haul it, I'm not sure yet. Okay, so we're just getting done with this. We're going to go ahead and unfold it. And we'll probably just park it in the yard for now. Actually, we'll park it in that other hay field until we get some room for the other tractor. For this tractor to get in there and rake, and that way it's out of the way. We'll probably do all that off camera. Or maybe, like, probably off camera, yeah. Um, yeah, we'll jump in the 4640. We'll start bailing. And then we'll probably haul it all when we get done. Okay, so we're done bailing. We're going to go ahead and park it down where the hay rake is. We'll park it behind that. And then we will go get the bale trailer, I think. And we might as well load it up quick. Um, I'll probably do that in a time lapse like I always do. We'll do that. I guess we are going to use this next. I didn't think we would use it this quick. But we're going to go ahead and take this down to the... Oh, I killed it. We're going to take it down to the hay field here. We're just going to shoot out that way and go that way. So we're going to see if we can get this pulled all the way up in here. And turned in. Now it's going to be a little tricky, I think. I think we can do it. I think we'll be able to do it. We'll have to drag the cradles a little bit. We got it in here. Coming out might be a little hard because it's going to want to pop a wheelie. But there shouldn't be too much of a load. Actually, there's probably 16 here. Or 10. I'm not sure. But we're going to try to park it on a somewhat flat area. Probably like right there. And we'll fold up the cradles. Go get the telehandler. And we will start a loading. Jump in there. Fork should be on. And we're going to go ahead and start loading some hay. Okay, so we made it to the hay field. We're just going to... I'm going to try and spear these two. Back up and get them speared in. And then I think I'll do a time lapse at the end of the video. I think I'll push them. I'll push them up this time. I need to get that grapple converted. I, didn't re I don't really have much time. Hopefully over winter break... I'll be able to do it. We'll stick our tires up as far as we can. And I did find out you can crawl up this if you're not careful. If you floor it, you can drive right up it. 
So anyway, we're gonna go ahead and load the hay and get it all loaded. I don't know if we'll haul it. Actually, yeah, I think we'll haul it. We'll go ahead and load it all up, haul it, stack it, and do all that. But anyway, hope you guys did enjoy the video. If you did, hit that like button, and we will see you all next time.